Hello everyone and welcome back to Sasha's blog, video blog. Very happy to be here with you and to talk to you about the song Black and Blue. This song has a rich history and I've been working on this tune for a long time. It all started when I wanted to write a musical and was looking for a good playwright and finally met with Bob Garrett who I really, really enjoyed collaborating with and writing. And when we started working on the musical, the main character, her name was Ruby, was a singer that eventually came from New York to Los Angeles and tried to make her career as a jazz singer and finally succeeded. But while she was working from the ground up, she really had a hard time with the fact that she was black and she was trying to sing to the audience that was primarily white. And one night when she was singing in the club, beautiful evening, she had a great performance, but several people from the crowd really booted her and even speeded on her. And when she came home to her uh, friend Lillian and started crying and expressing herself, Lillian comforted her and told her that life is just gonna be hard. It's not gonna be easy and she has to go through all these tough times with dignity, grace, and, and to be strong, and in the end she will succeed. And it helped Ruby a lot, like it helps a lot of people to really do what they believe in. And that was the song Black and Blue. We went to the recording studio with great, great musicians. Uh, I remember we recorded this at the NRG, and uh, the two singers, it actually eventually became a duet. Two singers were Alvin Chia and Glynis LaFleur. And they did such an amazing job, but it was also interesting the collaboration between them. They were in the two separate rooms. They were not in the same room, but it felt uh, in the headphones that they were standing next to each other and really, you know, talking to each other with great passion. So it's very inspiring and we actually recorded a beautiful video as well of this recording. Black and blue, no tears may fall. 